one uh, because it's a rainy day here in Reno I decided to make my Filipino dish soup called uh, beef nilaga it's a Filipino famous uh, soup so everybody loves it over there so I'm gonna show you my ingredients so here's the the beef this is a beef shank and beef brisket you can use one of each but today I decided to use both because I'm gonna try it so garlic ginger this is one head of garlic by the way because we love garlic and onions one red and one brown scallions uh, green beans celery five pieces of carrots or you can put more it's up to you if you like it and potatoes uh, cabbage and bok choy hi Bri are you ready for our soup? Okay, I'm gonna start it turn on to number seven and just add like a couple tablespoons of the oil okay now the oil is ready I'm gonna add the garlic uh, ginger and the onion and And I'm gonna add a little of this uh, thyme This is the thyme Yeah Carrot Black pepper And a little bit of salt The skin of salt There you go Smell the ginger already. And let it cook for like five minutes before you put the meat in. Okay. So I'm gonna put the the beef shank first because this is kind of a fat meat and a bone center. So I'm gonna put this first. And more seasoning. All of this will have time, so I use a lot of time. And pepper, black pepper. more pinch of salt and simmer this for like five or seven minutes and I'm gonna add water Bria you helping us cook tonight aren't you <laughs> you and me we're back up You were dad, I know. Okay. Yeah, you're my baby. Yes. Oh, I got you. I got you. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, where's Bria? Where's Bria? Oh, yeah. Okay, you little monkey. Ooh. You're like a lightning bug. You're everywhere, aren't you? Like a little lightning bug. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, sit down okay, right sit here. Okay, sit down now. And you help, okay? You just help us tell us what to put in next. Yeah. Come well, on, sit down. Sit down so that you won't fall down. Okay, Bria. Sit down. Sit down. Okay, I'm gonna add a little soy sauce and a little vinegar on it. Just a little splash. Not too much because you don't want your soup salty. There you go. And a little of vinegar. What is that? A few tablespoons? 
Yeah, it's like two tablespoons. All right. Okay, I think it's ready to put the the water too. So I'm gonna add the water. Oh, not that much. That's for later. That's what I give to Mama this one. Thank you. There you go. Turn this up a little. Okay, now it's been uh, cooking for five minutes. So you can see it's uh, boiling. And I'm gonna add more water. Two cups of water. But it's up to you if you like to if you like to drink soup, you can add more. And I'm gonna add also the beef broth. What is it? Beef? Beef broth. I, I don't want it. Ew, it's yucky. It's mommy. Mommy and daddy. Okay, I'm gonna add the fish, Asian fish sauce. Just add like a couple tablespoon. There you go. Look at this one. Yeah. And I'm gonna flip this beef chunk. It's cooking. Oh, it's simmering right now. Okay, it's been one hour simmering the beef chunk. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the beef. Brisket. Ooh, very hungry. And stories together. It's and we're gonna on. cook this beef brisket and the beef chunk for another two hours. So the total hour on this uh, recipe, the beef. Nilaga is 3 hours total. Okay, I'm gonna put this up high. And when it gets to boil, I'm gonna turn this down to number 3 to get it simmer. Well, it's funny. I, I just talked my dad today. I go ahead and call him. And that was very funny because they're cooking the same thing. Beef nilaga. And also, he taught me that when the beef shank is... Uh, hard to get tender it means the cow is old or the beef shot out the beef is easy to to get tender it means the cow is young so that's kind of you know and and he said when it's hard to get tender just keep adding water and just keep cooking it until it gets tender so you can't really follow the three hours or two hours it depends your meat if it's you know if it's hard or tender so it depends the meat if it's old or young so just keep checking it if it's uh, you know tender already it means it's done if it's not just keep refilling water you know and cover the meat just keep checking it so this is my dad's favorite uh, dish also so that's why he knows about it I'm gonna go ahead and taste the soup It tastes very good. The broth, it tastes really good already. I'm hungry. <laughs> I can't wait. Okay, I'm gonna add some vegetables. Carrots. Because this is, takes long to cook also. Celery. We don't like too much celery for the soup, so I just put a little bit. But if you like it, you can put more. <coughs> and green beans. And I'm gonna put more salt. Where's the food? There you go. And I'm gonna add the uh, potato because it's been uh, simmering for an hour an hour and a half almost two hours and the scallions and mix it together and we have to check also if the meat still covered with the water 
so I think it's still good. Oh, that one's still there already. Looks very good. And it tastes very good. There you go. Turn up high, and when it starts to boil, I'm gonna turn it down to simmer it for another, maybe another one hour. I'm gonna go ahead and add the last vegetables. It's cabbage and bok choy. Press this first, so that we have more room in the bok choy. There you go. I'm gonna turn this up high. Bring it to a boil again and turn it down later for another half hour. Simmer it for another half hour and it will be done. This is to be the final. <laughs> oh my. See, it's not gonna be crowded later. When it cooks later, it's gonna be pushed out. So it will be good. I'm going to get from the bottom, put it to the top. Okay. And I'm going to simmer it for half hour and it will be done. <laughs> okay, you can see that the meat is filled up from the bones already. So this is done. It's very tender and the vegetables are all cooked. So I'm gonna go plate and I'm gonna show you the final. Okay, there's the the beef chunk. Look at that, it's so tender. Ooh, fill up the bone. Eat it. Mmm. That's, that's all for today. And the beef nilaga recipe is simple and it's healthy to make. And it's a famous uh, dish soup in Philippines. So, that's all for today and thank you for watching. Bye. I hope you like the video. Bye.